Hi y'all. I'm wearing actual clothes today. How alarming is that? Because it appears that these days I literally do not even bother to get dressed anymore. Literally wearing a bonnet. Might be my favorite bonnet at the moment. We don't know. But my birthday, we're not even going to talk about that. Um, next week, Mr. has plans for Thursday, right? However, his vacation starts on Sunday. <laughs> and I know that he has plans for Thursday. So I'm going to work. Today is Wednesday. I'm going to work Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, right? However, I booked us a little staycation from Monday to Thursday morning. Really pushing it here because like I said, I already know ahead of time that he has plans for Thursday. So I just texted him and I'm like, please, outside of Thursday that I already know that he has plans for, I'm like, please do not make any plans for next week. I'm reserving you for pretty much all of next week, so do not make any plans outside of the day that you already made plans for, which I'm already aware of. He hasn't responded yet, which he's still at work, so I'm aware that he wouldn't have responded yet, but um, that is the plan. So what my plan is, book us a nice little staycation, if you will. I guess it's a vacation because we are going away. How does that work? Yeah, probably. But we're going to Atlantic City. I've gone to Atlantic City before and I absolutely loved it and we've spoken about going to Atlantic City and stuff and so I thought this would be the perfect opportunity. He has vacation, I have time, you know? It's perfect because after the next like two weeks, we don't know if we're gonna have that much time on our hands anymore. We're both gonna be working until we're dead pretty much. <laughs> so I figured, you know, it's still early in the year and what better way to configure all of this than to have a nice little getaway, you know, start the year off right. I feel like I could definitely use it and I feel like he could as well. So, um, we're going to do that. I'm looking into booking the hotel right now. Why I'm specifically getting that one is because it has like a kitchenette. So if we feel like making our own food, then we could absolutely do that because him as well as I love making our own foods. So that is an idea in our heads, right? We might not end up cooking at all and we might very well eat out all of those nights. Sometimes we feel so, you know that feeling that you get when you eat um, fast food? We've, we've talked about that before. We would leave Monday evening and we would check out Thursday morning probably just to make it work for whatever the plans are that he has. I don't know if I'm if I'm cutting it close because, I mean, when we're already there, if I'm cutting it close, then we can always scratch that and check out um, Wednesday morning or like Wednesday night so we can get back here in New York for Thursday for whatever it is that he does have planned because I don't wanna hijack his plans, but these are my plans, especially because right now he has vacation. The last time when I planned something for his birthday, he didn't have um, any vacation time. We're working with his days off. And his days off fell in the middle of the week. He had Wednesdays and Thursdays off, right? And his birthday was the following Saturday. So what I ended up doing was I booked the hotel for the Tuesday night. Wednesday night, we would check out Thursday morning. So we had... A, Two nights really and the Tuesday night he ended up getting there late because I knew that he was going to leave work late. So he ended up getting there late and um, so we really just spent one full night there. And we ended up having to drive back home for so many other things. This takes us away away. Nothing to drive back home for. And this is why I'm sp and it's a long drive home. This is why I'm specifically letting him know that I'm reserving you for all of these days so don't plan anything else. To make us have to come back we're not doing that so i need to get all my ducks in a row or at least sunday so i have pretty much wow three four days all right that's enough days because one thing about me i'm always ready to go i'm always in flight mode i don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing but i'm always ready to go you can plan a trip tomorrow and i will be ready tonight so that's great but considering the fact that i'm the one planning it god 
I really just realized that I, I might just be hijacking the man's plans here. Hopefully not. But um, this is great. I feel like we could both use the getaway. So we're gonna do that. But I wanted to like pop on here and like tell you guys before he even responded. I'm trying to see if I should adjust the contrast or like because we are outside. Normally I'll adjust the lighting, but at this point I don't really know. Hi guys, it's probably very, very loud right now because I feel like it's loud inside here. But I remember a couple days ago, maybe a week ago at this point, I said that I was planning to um, reserve Mr. for a couple of days. <laughs> and I was sitting down talking to my camera, telling you guys my plans and everything before I even texted him. So it was successful. We're on our way to Atlantic City. Um, and it should be a good couple of days. I'm, I'm presuming it's a long uh, drive to be completely honest, but I'm not driving, so I'm not worried at all. It's two hours and 40 minutes of just driving is a lot. Anyway, so we're, we're, we're driving there right now. Um, it's late right now. It's, it's, I'm looking, I'm so accustomed to like looking at my watch. Right now it's 425 and we're probably almost there. Maybe we have like an hour to go. Minutes. Oh, we have 30 minutes to go until we get there and I've, and we've already um, luckily passed the um, check-in time so that's good but um, yeah I just realized that this entire time I didn't even say hi I didn't even say anything ever since I made that one vlog it's raining it's been raining the entire time so it's a little bit gloomy but I feel like even if it's raining the entire time that we're there for it doesn't even matter because we're supposed to be relaxing you know that was the whole point of this whole thing so even if it's raining it's fine obviously it's the winter time so it's cold as fuck anyway so it doesn't even matter but this should be a good couple of days and i'm so so excited like i'm so excited to just get away from everything that would i would be around naturally and just enjoy a lot of time away which i feel like we both could use like i said when i had originally um filmed but um, yeah, we're headed there and that's really all. We're just driving and driving. There's nothing exciting, nothing to see really. So I will probably show you guys the place when we get there. I can't, the words are not really flowing right now. No, I mean, I don't know about all that, but like the, the room and stuff, you know? I did the packing. He doesn't even know what clothes are inside of the suitcase, as in literally. Like, anyways, gotta go. So guys, just got here and I'm gonna show you guys what the view is like. Okay, so the view is crazy, but I'm gonna show you the entire um, room. So this is the door. When you walk in, this is a closet to hang like our coats and stuff. This is the bathroom. This is literally my favorite part. This is my favorite part. Gosh, I'm so excited about this. Oh, I have plans. And then when you come out here, this is like the bedroom area. I got a suite. And then the view. The view is literally everything. Literally everything. You guys probably can't see me. This is the ocean. Maybe it's better if I do it in the daylight. Mm, that is the ocean. Oh, that's nice. All the way out. And then... There is like a dining table area and like a kitchen area. So like I was explaining, you have the option to cook if you want. The only thing I don't like so far is that there's no light over in this section. But I'm guessing this lamp here. How do you do that? Oh, I think I broke it. Oh. What's this? Oh, fuck. Let me not break things. I guess that light is supposed to provide like a little bit more light for this area and when it's the daytime then the huge windows will provide like way more light but it's like gloomy right now because it is raining outside anyways this is what the bedroom area looks like I love it this is literally what I pictured so nice 